Okay, go zoom in where you were when you first initially started writing, when you first initially started reading. It's so demanding. So Uthman sent a message of Hafsa saying, send us the manuscripts of the Quran so that way we may complete the Quranic material in perfect copies, right? Mm. Okay, one second. Did Hafsa have the original Quran? Supposedly. Okay, supposedly. Okay, I, I will rephrase that for you. She did. And therefore, they sent that original copy. That way they can copy it. The whole reason wow. why they were burned was because they were including different things into those other Qur'ans. So you, like you're twisting what you're literally reading. So then they weren't perfect then. Because they have other things added to it. Which is the reason why they sent a message wait, wait, wait. So then they're not to send so it they weren't to him. Perf wait, wait, so then they weren't perfect if other things were no, added to it. No, no, you're twisting it. No, I'm only going off by No, listen, you cannot sit there and talk about a small, like like a time in no, history no, 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 no. I'm without arguing talking your point. about before I'm taking your point. and then I'm after. Taking your point. I'm taking your point and arguing with it, right? So they had other things added to it, so then it wasn't perfect. I, 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 I genuinely, I don't like the back and forth and the constant. So then why are you here? Why are you having this live? To ask, Ru to ask Muslims why they aren't Christian. Yeah. Right? And so we can do the same. And I'm explaining so it to you, but you do same. not want to listen. So then Wait, go Ru do the Ru same. Ru Ruba, 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 look, look, look. We, we have these lives to have a full discussion. You're going to bring a point. You know, and it may be a good solid point, but we're going to examine what you said and we're going to use your logic and your reasoning for what you said, you know? So you're saying that Hafsa had the original Quran and the reason why this was going on, that the other copies were burned is because basically those other, like people were adding to the Quran, things that didn't belong or taking away. You just, it, it wasn't, it wasn't correct, right? So that's why he had the others burned, right? Do you know the time frame that you are talking about this hadith? Yes or no? Yes. That doesn't matter. It, it does matter. That's the whole Is point. It, it's still Sahih, isn't it? It's authentic. So let's let's stay with the root of so the matter. So one second. One second. Wait, 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 you Ruba, said Ruba, that Ruba. you know. You the root, the root, good God logic, whatever root, your name is. Ruba, you said respect, that you respectfully, know. Respectfully, please. Respectfully. The root of the matter is that this hadith gives us a recollection of where there were different Qurans that they had burned because they were incorrect. And so Uthman had to make sure that everyone had the correct Quran, right? So he had Hafsa send the original copy. They made copies of that one, rewrote that one, and sent those copies out to the rest and burned the others, right? Correct. Okay. Because they're trying to preserve it. Right, right, right. I know. I understand. So look, we I only brought this point up because the previous guest before you tried to make an argument that the Bible has been rewritten and so therefore cannot be trusted. And so we brought this point up to show how that's inconsistent because if that were if that were the case, if rewriting or making copies means that the Bible is corrupted, then this would mean that the Quran is corrupted because it was rewritten and co and made of copies. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I, I understand when you when you talk about it with that with that specific point. I mm -hmm. understand that 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 for Christianity, they state that it is not rewritten; it is translated in different translations. So therefore, right. those translations have different meanings. And and no. and. Well, what just, does I'm it just, mean to translate I'm, something? Well, yeah, yeah. So you're gonna, you're gonna, you, you just move from one language to another, right? Um, so you, you'll have. So I have a question for you. Like that, Let's say there not, is a it's word not corrupted or anything. Or, like, we have, can agree. Wait, I have can a we? Question. Yeah, I have before a you ask this, let's, let's just let's just solidify this point before we get move on. Okay. Go for it. So, so me, we can agree that rewriting or making copies does not mean that the text 
is corrupted, right? We can agree there because that would be silly to say that, right? If it is the same as the original, then no. If okay. they rewrite it, but something is included or something mm -hmm. is excluded, then mm -hmm. that means that it is corrupt. Okay. Agreed. Now, my question to you, okay? Mm -hmm. The original language of the Bible, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. When you say that something is translated, can mm -hmm. one word have multiple different meanings in different languages? Yes. Okay. Then we're on the same page, right? Mm -hmm. But my question to you is, why is it that when I meet Christians, Christians, or when I want to talk to Christians about their religion, right? Mm -hmm. There mm -hmm. are core values that in Christianity or in the original text that states that Christians shouldn't should do A, B, C, D, E and shouldn't do A, B, C, D, E, right? A religion is, is kind of like a, a, a guideline or, or, or it's a way of life mm -hmm. where God tells you, hey, do this and don't do this. Am I correct? Isn't that the way of, of, of living a meaningful life? Um, there's that's included when you're just obeying God and his guidelines that he has for you. So I'm, I'm following you. Okay. So why is it? And this is my, my question as a Muslim to you Christians. Why is it that if you put 20 Christians in a room, and I'm going to tell you that all 20 of these Christians are very well versed, are very well spoken, are, are very knowledgeable about their specific books and the translations and yada, 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 right? You put 20 people in this room and you ask them, can you do this? Five will say yes, five will say no. Can you do this? Five will say yes, five will say no. For example, well, in Christianity, aren't women supposed to cover and dress modestly? Yes. Okay. Do they do so? They're not, they're not supposed to. Now I understand right. doing an let me, act let me, let me, let me is different. You. Let, me, let me answer you, please. Um, so, no, in Christianity, you do dress modestly. You just, you, if you mean cover up as in your clothing, yes. If you're talking about covering up as in your head, no, that's not a requirement. Okay. So now, when you... Wanna, you... Now, if you want to talk about, you know, if you want to talk about failing women, who interpret scripture that way. That's perfectly fine. But the way that they interpret it is through during prayer or when, when they're in the church, that's that's when they fail. And I, I also wanted to say something else too, because you if, you, if you I put- I didn't understand. If you put, if you put 20 people, let's say you put 20 Christians in a room and they disagree on something, that doesn't mean that there's falsehood in the religion or anything like that, because I can say the same thing about Islam. I could put 20 Muslims in a room and ask them, where is Allah? And they would all disagree. Some would say above the throne. Some would say on the throne. Some would say around the throne. They would all disagree on this. Or if music is haram, some would say yes, as long or yes, music is haram. Some would say, oh, as long as it's positive, you can do it. Some would say, no, no, it's not haram, or haram at all. Uh, you know, like you, you have different people who give different opinions on a lot of things that I, 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 tell I, okay, I understand. Right. And, that, and that's based on 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 how deep you are in the religion. Right. Uh, it could be you, you can all be no, theologians. No, I'm and sorry. Still, no, no, no. Still be if, if you put 20 Muslims in a room and you talk about the fundamentals of Islam and what the book clearly tells you is a yes and a no, there is no there's no gray. It's black and white. But what I'm what I'm what I'm seeing is that in Christianity, there's a lot of gray that you created. Uh, no. Here's another question. So, Does it state that, that you? I don't think you're being fair, Ruba. You're not being fair to in in your critique here, because again, I, I literally I do lives all the time, just like Light does, mm -hmm. and I have I have this gag that I do where when Muslims start arguing with each other, I'll bring out popcorn. <laughs> In the middle of a conversation, when they're debating me, they end up debating each other because they're disagreeing on something that's supposed to be clear about Allah or about Muhammad and stuff like that. And so it's a little gag that I do. I bring out popcorn and I start eating the popcorn. But but that's that just I have so many examples of those. And matter of fact, I'm, I think I'm going to go back into my lives and just make a collage of it because it's it's funny. 
where Muslims are start fighting each other on a Christian platform over something that's supposed to be basic. It happens so often. It, it, I mean, it, it, it'll happen in Christianity where people it disagree. It just happened stuff. yesterday too, didn't it? It just happened. It just I had a whole entire for an hour and a half. They were going at it. Right. I just let I just let them cook. You know. Okay. So, but here's my thing. I'm being fair to this and saying this happens in Christianity too. Christians will disagree on things um, and uh, they'll do it on a platform. It happens in Islam too. Like it happens in all, in all types of worldviews. You know what I'm saying? Right. I don't, I don't think that that should be a, a judgment against the religion as a whole or a reflection of it. I, I just don't think so. It's God, not you.